Hey guys, welcome back. In the last video, we completed the blocking for the roofs, walls, and the floor, and we created this pipe and the wires. Let's try to create the door for this environment today. So go to front view, and let's create a door frame for this environment. And take a box, pull it up here and here open the parameters and increase its width height and depth Select these vertices and align them with this floor here. And the top ones with this ceiling. Place it all the way back here. And we need to add some more scale to it so scale it like this and this Now take insert edge loop tool and add one edge here. Now create a duplicate and place this duplicate on this side. Now select these two and combine. Go to face mode and select these two faces and bridge. So we are just trying to create a door frame here. Now let's select this edge and split it then bevel. Uh, let's increase the fraction a little bit and keep it 0 0.7. Now select these three faces. and uh, extrude increase the thickness let's keep it 7 so our frame is completed Now you can select this cylinder here and select the vertices of this corner and push them back a little bit. And select the vertices of this door frame these ones then pull them down to cover this empty area of this cylinder Now select this frame and isolate it. Now 
Now go to face mode and select the faces on the bottom and delete them. Now go to edge mode again and select these edges. and these edges on the corner let's select them too and bevel increase one segment and decrease some fraction let's try to keep it to 0.3 now you can go back to edge mode and select these two edges and delete them So we have created the door frame. Let's uh, create the doors. Take another box and bring it back. Pull it up. And change the width. Let's take 10 and depth to 10. Also, let's take height to 250. Pull it up like this. Go to back view. And go to vertex mode, select the vertices and snap them to this edge here. And these vertices to this floor. Let's scale it a little bit. Like this. And place it here. Now select it and again go to face mode. And now you can delete the top and the bottom face. Go to edge mode and select these edges. And now you can bevel them with a little bit of direction and one segment. So our door frame is completed. Let's create the doors. And for that, again, I'm going to take a cube. Pull it up and this way. Go to front view. And scale it. Go to vertex mode and Place these vertex here and these ones on this side. Pull these ones up and these two vertices down. Scale it down and bring it back here. Let's scale it down a little bit. Like this. And isolate it. Then take an insert edge drip tool and add one edge here. Let's select this edge, then 
split it and bevel and split it again pull this one up till here Uh, let's go to top view and face mode and select all these faces except the front ones and delete them for now go to face mode and delete this face Now extrude it, add some thickness, let's keep 7, and isolate it again. Now go to edge mode, select all edges and now you can bevel, decrease the fraction and increase one segment. Now go to front view and uh, let's take a cube again, pull this up like this, scale it, go to vertex mode, select these vertices and uh, place them here on this corner and these ones till here pull them back and scale it now go to face mode select this face and extrude then add some offset Uh, let's keep it free and then intrude it like this to add a little bit more depth just go to edge mode and select this edge then bevel and decrease fraction add one segment and uh, go to front view again select it let's uh, drag it down a little bit till here now take another cube bring this one here in the middle and scale it like this So this is going to be our glass, uh, we can assign a new material on this one, then increase the transparency. Like this. So 
so our door is completed so let's select all these deselect this one create a duplicate and place this one on this side now let's create a handle for these doors so take a cube again and pull this up go to front view place this one here and scale it then go to right view wireframe mode bring it back here like this and create a duplicate and scale that one and rotate it turn on the discrete rotation and create a duplicate of this one bring that one down here and rotate it again now select these three and combine go to face mode select these two faces and bridge change the curve type to blend and increase division Let's keep them three and repeat the same process for these two faces. Bridge, curve type to blend and increase divisions. Now what you can do is go to face mode, select these two faces and scale them with pressing shift like this. Now select this face and scale it. And now this one, scale it and attach it to this door. And you can also go to edge mode, select these edges. and then bevel with one segment increase the fraction a little bit create a duplicate and place this one here on this door that's it for today and i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and if you did then subscribe to the channel you can also join my discord and follow me on the instagram in the next video we are going to create some lights and then we will move on to unwrapping i'll see you in the next video thanks for watching